of it all, but just needs she needs an outlet for her energy. She's really, really smart. Mm -hmm. And how uh, old is she? She's only seven months old. Well, she's it's... not very large. She's probably close to full size. She might get a little bit bigger, mm -hmm. but uh, she'd be another great ranch dog for you. She's yeah, that she she's hurting. already she's already smelling the ranch stuff on the bottom of my yeah, shoes. Yeah, I mean, she likes <laughs> when it. When I she's... went out and checked the heifers today, she smelled yep. that. She feels right at home with you already. So that strong hurting. Yeah, she face. looks she looks like a little cattle dog. Yeah, uh, quick fast yep exactly uh, can dart from one spot to the next yeah she's uh, not a huge fan of cats so i don't know if that might work out well, well who is she has she been spaded since she's seven months yep she's already been spayed mm -hmm. she's microchipped vaccinated uh she, so she's ready to go home to go home as early as tomorrow uh, she's today. into the trash yep, she likes she likes the trash but again in case there must be maybe jerky yep there's a there jerky in there, there. Some <laughs> jerky in there. <laughs> so uh so when people People, uh, when people lose it, their dogs, do they come to you and you have the microchip information? Or do, if a vet finds a dog with a microchip, do they call you guys? Is so that how it works? They definitely can. Um, each mi There's a bunch of different microchip companies out there. And mm. so you'd scan the dog and your chip reader would tell you, okay, this is an AKC chip. Mm. And then most people just call that big company and mm. then they have the owner information. Mm. Or if somebody, you know, we can we scan dogs all the time for free. We can tell people uh, the number to call, yeah. help them get connected with the owner. It's essentially like a permanent ID oh. tag that can't ever fall out. Is, uh, is she a barker? Um, I haven't heard that she's a barker. She hasn't been with us that long. Uh, but I know she's wouldn't surprise me if she would get excited when yeah. she plays, although I haven't seen it myself. Mm -hmm. But she's young enough. You can I bet you can train her to what's acceptable behaviors and what's not. And, but, and, and where did that one come from? Uh, well, so, hi, buddy. So she actually came into us as a puppy a couple months ago, mm -hmm. got adopted and then was uh, brought back to us just mm -hmm. a day or two ago. And uh, you know, I'm confident we'll find her. A, oh, yeah, we'll find her a good fit. Sometimes you just don't know until you get them in the home. And yeah, well, a lot of people don't like big dogs, uh, they like a little smaller dog like that, so. yeah, smaller. And some people, I think, don't know quite when you get a herding breeder if you don't know about them. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they don't herd the kids, and then other times they do want to. They want to do that job and herd them to go here and mm -hmm. it can be kind of freaky for the kids even if the dog's not being mean so yeah. we'll find we'll find miss nanner here the the perfect fit i'm sure nice